And let's talk some more gospel right here on New Day on TV3. Now, John Upon Income, popularly known as John Wiener, is the man you just watched. And that's one of his songs, Odor. And uh, he's one who's known as an artist who puts a lot of money into his video. So he won uh, the Foresight uh, Music Video Awards in 2019, bits all his uh, contenders in the gospel category. And now we have him in the studio to have a conversation because he's asking us to lift our hands. Oh my God. How are you doing? I'm good by the grace of God. You know, when I see your videos, I'm like, ah, this guy, is sure he's a tema based guy. <laughs> <laughs> you, you always shoot videos as if you're living, I don't know if you go there or is there's a way they infuse this into your video, like you're outside the country. I go there actually, mm. but before then, uh, I have a brand promise, and my brand promise is excellent. So I oh, don't wow. do anything beneath excellence. I see. So I go the extra mile to do stuff, especially when it comes to work and work ethics. So I travel out there. Uh, but basically, what I try to do is that I marry um, artistry and music manship with the corporate world. Mm. So when I go there, most of the things that I show in my videos are products that I'm I'm, I'm promoting. Okay. All right. So I'm building a business um, around my ministry. Mm. So it's not just about the traveling and just going out there. You know, it's not about that. But it's more to create business contacts and also have certain links and networks. And you know, I like the fact that I'm creating business. Or I'm building business around my ministry. Right. Yeah. You know, this is one thing that many people do not think about. You know, I have a passion to sing, and they are singing. If money comes, praise be to God. If money doesn't come, I'm doing the work of God. But you are deliberate about it. That's a big. Because I'm a brand, okay. Mm. So of course I have to marry other brands, and uh, I have to use my franchise as well. As it stands now, I have a clothing line by hey. the special grace of God. I see. John uh, John yeah. Oh. So I try to intermarry what I do, mm. yeah, to mm. make a living. Because uh, Ghanaians are now buying into what we're doing, the urban contemporary thing. So for the meantime, we need to get other things that would also hold us. I'm a, I'm a property broker as well. Hey. I, have a, I have a small market, sales and marketing consortium. You wait. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll bring you a bill because this one, they are telling us all your business. But let's, let's, talk, about, let's talk about gospel music. Sure. And I'm, I'm thinking to myself that you're doing all these because that is, cannot be your only source of revenue. That's it doesn't fetch true. much, does it? For now, I think it's paying. Mm. For now, it's paying. Ghanaians are recognizing what we do, so it's paying. Uh, but the business, yes, it has to come in so that it will work hand in hand because uh, I, I'm a frontline missionary. I stand for the less and the privilege. I'm a voice for the lonely society. I have a foundation, one to go that takes care of people who don't have the funds to be in the university. Mm. You know, and I'm for the streets. I visit them and feed them. So. I do few philanthropic works as well. Mm. Uh -huh. So you know. And you forgot to add that you are, you are an salutation ambassador. Oh or, my God. Maybe because he's not happy about you know <laughs> no, the I state am. of Accra. No, I am. I am. I am. I am. I am. I'm super happy about it. And really? I'm, yes. You're I'm, happy about the state of uh, Accra no, with regards no, to sanitation? No. I'm as working. an ambassador? No, I'm. I'm not. So I'm trying. Uh, last year I did one. I did Jama for Jesus. Mm -hmm. I, I I took care of the whole of uh, Sakumono area, mm. Spintex. Uh, mm. We had a, small, mm. a good cleanup mm. exercise with the help of Zoomline and a few entities here. So, so so does that come with a fee, you know, or is just a free ambassadorial role that has been placed <laughs> on your head? I think it's, it's more of a free thing. Mm. It's more voluntary. Okay. Uh -huh. And that's my passion. Mm. Uh, I love it when it's voluntary. I find we are praying that very soon the corporate world will buy into what we're doing mm. because we give them equal value for money. So and gospel music is one of the most biggest selling contents in Ghana, whether we choose it or not. So we are hoping that they will jump on board. For now, we are pushing it, we are working, but we are also hoping they will jump on board and we make it bigger. And you have a new tune. I think you released it last month. Yes, yeah. please. Yes, please. Lift our, lift, lift, I lift my hands I in lift worship. I lift my hands in worship. I shot that in Dubai with uh, with the help of my big brother, Ezekiel Teto, Step. Oh, God, Steve went with God, you. God bless you. Yeah, ah. we shot three videos actually. So okay. Ghana should get ready. Another video is coming very soon, but this is what we're promoting for now. Prior to our projectional plan. So what what do you intend that I lift my hands does, you know, to people who are not gospel because you already have the gospel market. So yeah. let's talk about the secular folks. You're saying I lift my hands in worship. How does it penetrate that that uh, sector and how do you hope that you know it gets to get the attention? Good. Actually, I'm not your regular gospel artist. I see that. I am a frontline missionary. I am for the streets. Mm. Uh -huh. And we all know what um, this uh, 2020 happened with all this COVID issue and all that. People are so cool. People just went into their shelves. This is a time that we reflect on the love of God. Go back 
to the saving grace of our Lord Jesus Christ. Anybody out there was even scared when COVID came in. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So if you are still alive and we are all alive, you just need to lift your hands and worship him because that is it. whether you are Christian, you are an unbeliever, whatever, you have life and God has blessed you with it. So you have to lift your hands and worship. So I only brought, uh, it's a wake up call for people to run back to their first love with God, mm -hmm. regardless of their religious uh, um, stance and what they believe in. But we all believe there's a supreme being. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I stand as a Christian, let me say for the urban gospel fraternity, we preach the gospel through anointed music which is not necessarily a journal, but more of a message. You know, so people are ready to listen to the word of hope. And this is what I'm bringing to them. I lift my hands in worship is a word of hope to encourage somebody and let you know that listen, just lift your hands in worship because your worship will make everything happen. Your worship is your place where God will also see you through life. Well, let's lift our hands in worship. Let's watch the video. <laughs>